Hey guys, this is Greg from Orange Tree Samples. So here's the interface for Evolution Rosewood Grand, and I just wanted to give you a walk through the different controls available. So first of all, in the memory section, we have a polyphony meter, which tells you how many voices you've used. Um, then we've got the soft polyphony limit control, which means that once you pass that limit, uh, it looks for notes that have almost completely decayed or soft notes, and then just kind of gently fades those out in order to conserve polyphony. Uh, next we have the sample mode which allows you to choose between different numbers of dynamics and round robin and that way the piano library can take just a little memory or a lot of memory based on how detailed you need it to be. Uh, next we've got the sympathetic resonance that you can turn on or off. And then finally in this section we have the damper impulse uh, quality which just affects the amount of CPU that the damper uses. Alright so next we've got the levels and that just allows you to control the volume of different elements such as pedal noise, the hammer release noises, release samples, damper ambience, and then the general noise floor. Uh, all the samples have been denoised and then uh, the noise floor control al allows you to add that noise floor as a constant you know, back into the equation. Uh, next we've got the velocity and it gives you a nice little uh, dynamics curve here that you can adjust to suit your liking or your MIDI controller and whatnot. Um, and then you can also set the low and high limit or even humanize that. Um, for example, if you're, if you're typing in your piano sequence note by note in your sequencer, you might need to add a little bit of humanization just to make sure that there's that natural velocity uh, uh, variance. So then we've got a few effects. Um, an EQ right here with uh, three bands, uh, a vintage mode, which uh, is explained in more detail in the manual and then uh, a timbre shift control which basically just shifts the samples in order to give you uh, uh, different um, piano tones so a very bright piano versus a very dark piano. Um, we have a compressor uh, and all the usual controls you would see in a compressor and then also vintage mode which is again explained in the manual and uh, then a, a reverb um, which has this is the built-in contact reverb uh, and the vintage mode is basically changes the coloration of the reverb tone. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video and please like and share it. You can go to orangetreesamples.com to check out the rest of our sample libraries. Also, visit us on Facebook, Twitter, and Google Plus to connect with the Orange Tree Samples community. Thank you for watching.